This serves as an entry voucher for Minos escape rooms. Be the first to escape our most immersive room yet. And win a million dollars. So, uh, when does the game start? No one's ever done this before. No one's ever seen this laid out in a, in a movie uh, format before. So that's cool. And then as far as like the psych thriller element of this movie, uh, it does differ because of the horror elements, like I was saying. So nothing is really played strictly for horror or for psychological uh, thrill effect. You know, it's all somewhere down the middle of the two. And that's been really neat to kind of keep that ball in the air, you know, the idea that the stakes couldn't be higher physically. We, we, we can die. But there is also this, who do you trust? Who would do, the, who would do this to us? Guy, 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 who would do this to us, I guess, sort of element of it all. That's like, it's really fun to play the, the horror and the, the, the mystery of it all. I think this is the escape room. We should look for clues. What are we looking for here? Anything that looks like a puzzle or a code. It looks like an oven dial. That looks real. It's kind of warming up in here. Uh, excuse me, I would like our hit now, please. Well, that's creepy. The idea that the sets are kind of characters themselves is like, it's, an, it's a nice notion. You know, you think about it and you're like, oh yeah, okay, sure, the sets are characters. And then you get onto those sets and they really, they absolutely are. We live in these rooms for a long time as actors. I mean, the, the, the ice room we were in for two weeks, over two weeks. So you become very intimate with the space and with the you know, sort of elements at play in there. And it really does take on a life of its, its own. Is it getting hotter? How do we get out of here? It's Fahrenheit 451. Got it. Ah! Talk about immersive. What's wrong with you? That was real. Adam, as a director, really sort of is bringing elements of horror into this kind of otherwise psychological thriller type movie, <clears throat> which I think can kind of go hand in hand really well. The idea that we're going through a lot of uh, emotional tumult in this movie, as well as the sort of like what's around the corner element of the movie can, uh, can play well together. Are we outside? Let's see if we get this figured out. Let's see if we get the hell out of here. 